I learned that. I had taken a class in graduate school, and the professor passed out a bunch of business cards. And he said, what's the matter with these business cards? And we all looked at him and said nothing. He said, look at the backs. There's nothing on the back of the business cards. You know, it's perfect space. Don't go to waste. Absolutely. Yeah. Thank you. You're welcome. I noticed your Ron Paul hat. Um, yep. Yeah, that's, that's sharp. And uh, your raw, raw milk shirt. So you've got a lot of gear on today. <laughs> but how far did you travel to be here? 30 miles. Oh. <laughs> Well, that was not a terrible ride for no, you. Um, no. So, can I ask you a couple of questions? You mind um, okay. filming? Did you see my raw milk? No, I didn't. There it is, <laughs> raw milk nation. So, why is uh, raw milk? Why is Ron Paul? Why? Why are you here? Why is this issue important to you? This is important to me because someday, maybe, I might be a grandfather, and I don't want my grandchildren eating the same crap that all the other children now are eating. I want a healthy, happy grandchild. I don't want a kid who has ADHD. I don't want a kid that's going to be obese by the time they're 10 years old. I don't want a kid who's going to get type 2 diabetes by the time they're 15. I want a healthy, happy, active kid that can do more than sit on their butt and play video games. I think we can all agree that we all want that. So yep. how do you think that is achieved? This is achieved by all of us coming out more and more, putting more pressure on the FDA, trying to get this stuff on the news, which the news will not cover, because if they do cover it, then Monsanto will have McDonald's and all these people pull their food ads, the pharmaceutical companies will pull their drug ads, because they're all interrelated. We've got to bust through the barrier and just say no. We've got to get GMOs labeled, and that's just the start. So I notice uh, with, with the Ron Paul hat, I'm, I'm curious, what do you think the role of the federal government is in regulating food? The role of federal government is to get the hell out of food. Get out of food and let us eat food that is healthy. Are you concerned at all that by asking the FDA to uh, regulate food that they'll um, do something nefarious, maybe like uh, give their, their buddies um, uh, special privileges that other people don't have? They're doing it now. They're doing it now, just like this. They're sending Homeland Security here to intimidate us and, and try and break us. It's just their way of, of being here, just trying to trying to break us and intimidate us. So, well, uh, do you, you know, do Homeland you... Security is the biggest fraud perpetrated on America in the last 15 years, and you can thank George W. Bush for doing that. What do you think is the role of law enforcement here today? Intimidation, plain and simple. We're peaceful, we're nonviolent. They're here to try and intimidate people who can be intimidated and the thing is don't be intimidated by them. Have you done any outreach or spoken with any law enforcement here today about the issues? No, it's not worth it. It's not worth it. It's like talking to that wall. All right, well thank you for, so much for your time. And also one more thing. Yes. They can't, they can't agree with you because they'll get a desk duty watching the men's room. Oh, so yeah, you think uh, that even though the law enforcement may agree with the issues yes. that they can't say it. Oh no, they can't say anything. Your hands are tied. Okay, thank you very much. Thank you.